yes, the shooter came in and started shooting everybody around. A guy just came in and started shooting yeah. everybody? One guy? Uh, so far, well, what I heard is only one, but yeah. many are here too. Some saying two. Some yeah. saying two, and... Just dressed on black. Just dressed on black, like an assault assault rifle, I guess, uh, uh, like a, a AK, AK and a, vest. And a ve uh, bulletproof vest and such. And... Many are here too. Some saying two. Some saying two, and just dressed on black. Just dressed on black, like an assault assault rifle, I guess, uh, uh, like a, a AK and a, vest. And a uh, bulletproof vest and such. And then started shooting everybody. A guy just came in, and started shooting yeah. everybody. One guy. Well, what I heard is only one, but many are here too. Some saying two, and just dressed on black. Just dressed on black, like an assault assault rifle, I guess, uh, uh, like a, a AK and a, a, vest. And a, a bulletproof vest and such. And how long did the event last? How long did they did it take? Fifteen minutes. Fifteen minutes. He just walked in and started shooting. Wow. It felt like forever though, probably. And you guys were in the store at the time. Yeah. Wow, man! I was I by the outside. You were outside and you heard a pop, 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 pop. Wow. Uh huh. We came together, but he was uh, we were separating. He just started hearing that. <laughs> At first, I thought something broke. Yeah. And he just started hearing it constantly. People, people started screaming like, "Oh shit!" Wow. And any are you any of you guys uh, concealed carriers or yeah, yeah. you are? Yeah, I was, for, I was with some people behind the uh, the desk helping you, out. Sure. So after that, when the I started hearing the gunfire, when there was a guy outside. So when I tried to go outside, a uh, little girl had come in uh, crying, so I was like, okay. So you started helping her yeah, out? Yeah, so I, we let her in with but, her mom. But you didn't probably bring your weapon today, did you? Oh, you got it. Yeah. Okay, man. So you were protecting everybody. Yeah. Wow, good for you. Thanks, yeah, man. So. Thank you so Thank much you. for that. That's what I, I think we try to express the importance of having concealed yeah. carry because did it? Did you know how the, the guy got neutralized? Is he neutralized or is he cordoned oh, up? He ran out. Yeah, he ran out. Oh, he ran out of the store, so he's out somewhere. Yeah. Well, he, what I supposedly heard, remember. they got him at Sierra Vista. Oh, they picked him up at Sierra yeah. Vista. Oh, wow. So. That's crazy, man. That's crazy for El Paso. You didn't expect it really here, right? Yeah, this we weren't expecting it. Yeah. yeah. Today, I wasn't going to take my gun either. So. Right. It's, and I, and today, I was like, I decided to bring it. That concealed carry is vital, man. Yeah. Vital for, our, for and you guys are now. I bet you're gonna go get concealed carry now, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you have the story. You have uh, people said the man went in here. He was wearing all black, and he just started shooting. He's not sure if it's one or two shooters, but it was one shooter, and that they that they, that they were able to identify. And that one shooter then left Walmart and ran east toward the Sierra Vista Mall. Gonna go over here to the EMTs. How you doing, man? Yeah, yeah, man. All right, bro. How are you doing? Good. Did you get any info yet? Yeah, yeah, These guys were. Yeah, How you doing, yeah, man? Yeah, yeah, man? All right, bro. How are you doing? Good. Did you get any info yet? Yeah, yeah, These guys were. Uh, uh, the gentleman in. Where's he at? He left. They were inside when the shooting happened, man. I got some good info from these guys. Yeah, uh, he, they disappeared. They, they must have left. How you doing, man? Yeah, man. Alright, bro. How are you doing? Good. Did you get any info yet? These guys were... Uh, the gentleman in... Where's he at? He left. They were inside when the shooting happened, man. 
I got some good info from oh, these guys. Serious? Yeah, uh, he, they disappeared. They, they must have left. So the Horizon City Police Department um, just tweeted that, uh, so, all right, so right now police are trying to figure out what, if any, connection there may have been to the shooting at the Walmart at Sierra Vista Mall and an incident, as it was told to us, happened at the Walmart in Horizon. I'm not sure what time this tweet went out, however, oh, okay, here it is, at 3 p.m. Well, that's, that hasn't happened yet. Okay, so today is the third. All right, this is... Here you go, guys. Oh, uh, um, by Diego. Diego, you were at the Cinemark uh, movie theater watching a movie when this happened. What can you tell us? Yes, sir. I was watching a movie, and, and when we were watching it, halfway through, we heard fireworks, what it seems to be fireworks, and quickly we realized there were gunshots. My granddad, who's a Vietnam veteran, he, he said, look, we got to get out of here. We rushed out of the, out of the, out of the, out of the theater, excuse me, and the managers had told us that we couldn't leave. Correct. Right. That were telling us what the um, what the shooter had looked like and, and what and what exactly were going on. There were tons of people rushing in the movie theater trying to seek refuge, mainly from the Walmart across the, uh, across the way. And you said people were telling you what the shooter looked like. What were they telling you? Uh, yes, sir. I inquired directly um, with, with my aunt. She was in the Walmart at the time, and she had told me that the, that the the shooter was carrying some sort of like uh, assault rifle-looking uh, gun that looked like an AK, and she had. saying throughout, throughout the shooting, she said that he, he appeared like he was in a sort of rampage. He, he was shouting that, that gamers need to rise up and, and we need to make a, a new revolution, some, some crazy word like that. And my, my aunt was babbling. Did you say gamers need to rise up, as in people who play video games? Is that what you said? Um, yeah, I'm, I'm not sure. I don't play video games myself, but that is what my aunt told me. She had said that the, game, uh, that the, the gunman had said gamers rise up. And we need to we need to create a new revolution or something along the lines of that. And your aunt is okay. Yes, she's okay. What what uh, else did she? Talking to EMTs. Okay, what else did she tell you? What else did she see? When she was in the Walmart, there, there were tons of people stumbling uh, across the, uh, to, to get away from the entrance. That's where the gunman had came in. The gunman had had an assault rifle, like I said, and, and he was just shooting people down indiscriminately. My aunt said that he was targeting mainly Hispanics, and then he said, you know, uh, he said many derogatory racist things against Hispanics and, and some things about Jews, and he mentioned a site called uh, 8chan in his, in his ravings. Okay, so that, that's according to your aunt who was who was there at the Walmart. You were at the movie. Yes. You were at the movie theater, um, and you said they stopped the movie. Uh, wh where did you guys go immediately? Did they bring up the house lights? Did they, did somebody come in? What what happened? Did yes. you just go through the exit? Um, what did you do? manager himself uh, had came in. Uh, I believe that our other employees were doing the same. They had, they had turned on the house lights. They had ordered us all out of the theaters and into the main room while they had locked down the area. Okay, were you in fear that this was happening at the movie theater? Or did they t did, you, did you realize this was somewhere else? What, what were you thinking? Yes, I, I had assumed that there was another gunman because I was hearing more shots. I don't know if it was from a different gun, but that there were more shots, uh, particularly to the west. I had a compass on my phone. I looked and there were gunshots coming from the west. I would like to Okay, so um, I believe from the movie theater, the, the the Walmart is to the west of the movie theater, is it not? Yes. Okay, um, and and so how long were you there in the movie theater, and what did they tell you? They had told us that we need to stay put because if we go outside, that there was a potential risk that we might get shot, and particularly raped by African migrants. Okay, um, and uh, Diego, um, what are you, what are you? What are your thoughts on all of this? I, we've been talking to everybody I'm, who I'm, nobody who can I'm believe this is happening. Taken back, and I'm, I'm just you know amazed that you're a real dumb fuck, aren't you? Okay, so that may not have been somebody. We may have just been uh, lied to by all of that. So talking to everybody I'm, who I'm, nobody who can I'm believe this is happening. Taken back, and I'm, I'm just you know amazed that you're a real dumb fuck, aren't you?
The El Paso Walmart, where 22 people were killed in a shooting earlier this month, will be completely renovated before it reopens. Walmart is reportedly planning to revamp nearly everything inside the store, including the layout, flooring and fixtures. The reconstructed store will also include a permanent memorial honoring the victims of the shooting. Walmart's senior director for national media relations told CNN the company is looking for input from the community on the design. Walmart says the project is expected to take between three and four months to complete.